All right, Crush, here is your Wednesday workout. This is what I'm really, this is the, this is the stuff, I, I like this kind of stuff. So what we're gonna find today, we're gonna 15 minutes to find a heavy power clean and push jerk, or shoulder to overhead, shoulder overhead anyhow. So power clean, no squat, and then shoulder overhead. You cannot squat today. Part of this is not squatting, so most people, that's fine, they're fine with not squatting. But some of the people, to get really, really heavy will wanna squat, no squatting today. 15 minutes to find a heavy power clean and jerk. Get heavy with it. And then when we're done with that, we're gonna go at 80% of the weight you just found. So let's say the guys get the 200 pounds. They're gonna do 30 power clean and jerks for time. Grace, AKA Grace, at 160 pounds. In fact, as I'm reading this, I might bump this up to 85 or 90. Be, I wanna be really heavy power clean and jerks. Now today, talking about a weight belt. If we find a really heavy power clean and jerk, for that first part of the strength, as you get to the really heavy ones, some people would say 85 to 90% of your max is where you should start using a belt. So if we're finding a really heavy one, a belt is might be something you use. Again, I won't use it, but I can see where people would. But again, if you put that belt on, and you're standing there breathing, getting ready, and then you just go bend over and pick it up, you never tighten up that belt, you never cinch that belt, it's not doing you what it's supposed to do. It should be tight. It should be a tight belt. If you watch people that lift and use belts and they lift professionally, as soon as they're done lifting, they loosen that belt because they want to be able to breathe. So when you do that one rep, you're going to want to tighten it up and, and skid heavy. So now let's say you find a really, 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 like you just crush it and you find a really heavy power clean and jerk for you today. And now you got to do 30 of them at like 85 or, or so percent really heavy. Maybe use the weight belt there too. Maybe try to do 10 or 15 without it and then you kind of slap that on there to kind of help you out. But again, you're gonna be breathing really, really hard, which means you have to loosen the weight belt, tighten the weight belt, loosen the weight belt, tighten the weight belt, loosen the weight belt, tighten the weight belt. If you keep it loose all the time, again, it's not doing you any good. Why even wear it? It's not doing you any good, it's just decoration. I'm looking forward to Wednesday. I think Wednesday's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, have a good Wednesday.